Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. My name is Wyatt, and today I'll be teaching you how to script a group rank door on Roblox. Okay, so before I show you how to make this script, I want to show you how it works. So, if we just go right into the game, as you'll see, if you're a certain rank in the group, you'll be able to go right up to a door and pass right through it. Okay, so now that you know what the script does, I want to show you actually how to make it. So to start, you're going to need a door model in your game. So I just have the model and then a part inside of it named door with a capital D. This is just so that your script will have something to reference so it'll be able to open or close the door. Now the first thing we're going to want to do is create a local script under starter GUI. And the reason we're going to do this is because the way it works, this door works, is when you join the game it checks what the player's rank is and if it's a certain if it's above a certain rank it'll make a door can collide false so you'll be able to pass right through it but if you're not the rank it'll set can collide equal to true so it doesn't have to destroy the door and re recreate or anything like that it just sets can collide on the door based on your rank condition when you join the game so if we go over to the script right here let's just name it group rank door script and so inside this script we'll actually have the code that makes this door work. So we'll say local player, because we need a reference to the player, equals player, And we also just want to have a reference to our door part. So yours might not be in this exact format, but my door part is right here. So I'll just say local door part equals game dot workspace dot door, which is this model right here, dot door and that'll be the door part that will set can collide to false and we'll, we want to specify the minimum rank number so if you go to your group page for whatever it is there will be rank numbers for all the different roles in your group this is going to be if the person is of this rank or greater the door will open for them so in my case local minimum rank for my group equals two and the group ID for mine local group ID Right here, I'll just paste it in. This is the group ID for my group. So you need both of these parameters for this to work. Now, what we want to do is actually check the player's rank in the group. So we're going to say if player colon get rank in group, and then we'll pass in the group ID because that's what we need to specify. And if that rank number is greater than or equal to the minimum rank, then We'll print player is at or above minimum rank and now we'll say otherwise if they're not of the minimum rank or above we'll say print player is not at or above minimum rank and now so this just has these are just print statements so they don't really do anything but if we go into the game you'll see right down here in the output It'll say, if we just give it a sec, it'll say player is at or above minimum rank. So that means for what, when I go into the game, whatever code is under here, it's going to do it. But if someone went into the game and they weren't of that rank, it would do whatever code is under here. So what we're going to say, super simple, just door part, which is this door part again right here, dot can collide equals false. And and all that's going to do is make it so they can't they can pass through the door you know it's go right through and then otherwise we're just going to say door part dot can collide equals true so whenever they try to go through the door it stops them so if we just go into the game we can test this out real quick as you'll see all we have to do is walk right on up to the door and we can pass right through thank you so much for watching guys i hope you learned something new today about scripting on roblox as always, I'll have the pasteman link with the code and the Roblox model link for everything shown in this video in the description, and I'll see you later.